Imagine stepping into a world bursting with colors, where each flower dances in the breeze and every corner teems with life. Welcome to Nature's Haven, where today we're bringing this vision to life in your own backyard. We're embarking on a journey to create a stunning wildflower garden, a haven not just for you but for the local wildlife too. So, grab your gardening gloves, and let's dive into the vibrant world of wildflowers. Planning your wildflower garden, start by choosing a sunny, well-drained spot. Research native wildflowers that flourish in your area. These local heroes are not only easy to grow but also vital for supporting local ecosystems. Selecting the seeds, mix it up with annuals and perennials for a garden that keeps on giving all year round. Aim for a kaleidoscope of colors and forms to create a visually stunning display. Preparing the soil, a successful garden begins with healthy soil. Clear out weeds, loosen the soil, and enrich it with compost for that extra fertility boost. Planting your seeds, it's time to get down and dirty. Scatter your seeds evenly, gently press them into the soil, and give them a light watering. Remember, wildflowers thrive under natural conditions, so there's no need for deep planting. Caring for your garden, water your garden during dry spells and keep an eye out for invasive weeds. With a little love and care, watch your wildflower garden come to life. Enjoy the natural benefits. As your garden blooms, it becomes a buzzing hub for bees, butterflies, and other pollinators, contributing to local biodiversity and bringing the joy of nature right to your doorstep. Deep dive into wildflower gardening. Select the right wildflowers, adapt your choices to your local climate and ecosystem. A diverse range ensures a colorful display. Design your garden thoughtfully, consider the heights, colors, and bloom times of different plants. Mix annuals and perennials for continuous blooms. Soil health is key, test your soil and amend it with organic matter. A clean, nutrient-rich soil is your garden's best friend. Planting done right. Mix seeds with sand for even distribution. Gentle pressing ensures good contact with the soil. Maintenance tips. Once established, wildflower gardens need minimal watering. Regular weeding, however, is crucial. Wildlife wonderland. Your garden will become a hotspot for various pollinators and birds, creating a thriving ecosystem. Seasonal splendor. Enjoy the changing tapestry of your garden throughout the year with each season bringing its unique beauty. Sustainable practices and community involvement. Incorporate sustainable gardening practices and engage with your community. Share seeds, participate in local events, and even use your garden for educational purposes. Experiment, adapt, and connect with nature through your wildflower haven. Closing thoughts. A wildflower garden is more than just a space of beauty. It's a living, breathing ecosystem right in your backyard. It's a journey of discovery, connection, and contribution to the environment. So, let's embrace this journey together. If you're inspired to create your own slice of paradise, hit the like button, subscribe, and ring the bell for more nature-inspired gardening tips. Share your progress, ask questions, and let's cultivate a community of wildflower enthusiasts. Until our next green adventure, keep gardening and keep growing. And as we journey through the seasons with our wildflower gardens, let's share our experiences. Your garden is not just a personal retreat, it's a living canvas that reflects the changing seasons and the diverse beauty of nature. Here are more ways to enhance your wildflower gardening experience. Photography and artistic expression capture the fleeting beauty of your garden through various art forms. Whether you're photographing the dew on petals at dawn or sketching the vibrant hues of sunset blooms, use your garden as a muse. Share your creations on social media using hashtag Nature's Haven Gardens and let's build a gallery of wildflower wonders. Seasonal themes and color palettes challenge yourself each season. Plan spring gardens with soft pastels, summer displays in bold, vibrant colors, and autumn scenes in warm, earthy tones. These evolving themes keep your garden visually exciting and continually inviting. Companion planting for a thriving ecosystem, delve into the symbiotic relationships between plants. For example, 
Pairing certain herbs with your wildflowers can help deter pests naturally. This not only enriches the biodiversity in your garden but also promotes a healthier ecosystem. Sustainable garden structures Create eco-friendly garden structures. Use recycled materials for garden paths, benches or trellises. This not only adds character to your garden but also aligns with the ethos of sustainability and environmental stewardship. Community involvement and events your garden can be a catalyst for community engagement. Host seed exchanges, garden tours, or workshops right in your wildflower haven. Encourage your neighbors to start their own gardens, forming a network of green spaces that support local wildlife and foster community spirit. Reflecting and growing, remember, every garden is a learning experience. Reflect on what worked and what didn't, and don't be afraid to experiment. Each season is an opportunity to grow not just your garden but also your skills and knowledge as a gardener. Creating a wildlife-friendly habitat, go a step further and make your garden a sanctuary for wildlife. Install birdhouses, bat boxes and even a small pond. These additions increase the ecological value of your garden, making it a haven for various species. Final thoughts, as we wrap up, remember that your wildflower garden is more than just a space of beauty. It's a testament to your dedication to nature, a contribution to local biodiversity, and a place of continual learning and enjoyment. Share your journey with us, engage with the community, and let's spread the joy of wildflower gardening far and wide. As we cultivate our wildflower gardens, let's not forget the impact we're making. Every flower, Every insect it attracts, contributes to a larger story of ecological balance and beauty. Here's how we can deepen our connection with nature and our community through our gardens. Educational opportunities, transform your garden into a classroom. Whether it's for your family, friends, or local school groups, use your wildflower haven to teach about plant biology, pollination, and ecosystem conservation. Create informational signs about different species and their roles in the environment, turning a stroll in your garden into a learning adventure. Seasonal celebrations. Mark the changing seasons with small celebrations in your garden. Host a spring bloom party or a harvest gathering in the fall. These events can become cherished traditions, bringing people together to appreciate the beauty and bounty of nature. Wildlife observation and documentation. Turn your garden into a citizen science project. Document the types of birds, insects, and other wildlife that visit. Share these observations with local nature groups or online citizen science platforms. This data can be invaluable for conservation efforts and helps you become a more informed gardener. Meditation and mindfulness. Use your garden as a space for reflection and relaxation. Practice mindfulness or meditation surrounded by the natural beauty you've helped nurture. This can be a profound way to connect with nature and find inner peace. Art and garden collaborations. Collaborate with local artists or schools for art projects inspired by your garden. Host painting sessions, photography contests, or poetry readings in your wildflower haven. This not only celebrates the beauty of your garden but also fosters a deeper cultural appreciation for nature. Garden Tours for Charity Open your garden to the public for tours, with proceeds going to local environmental or community charities. This is a wonderful way to share your passion while supporting good causes. Connecting with other gardeners Join or create online forums or local clubs for wildflower gardeners. Share tips, seeds and stories. These connections can be a great source of support, inspiration, and friendship. Seasonal wrap-up and planning for next year. As each gardening season comes to a close, take time to document what you've learned and plan for the next year. Maybe there's a new species you want to try, or a garden design change you'd like to make. Gardening is an ongoing journey of discovery and creativity. Final message. Your wildflower garden is more than just a plot of land. It's a microcosm of the natural world, a place of beauty, learning, and connection. We hope this guide inspires you to start your own wildflower journey and to see where it takes you. Remember, every seed you plant is a step towards a more beautiful and sustainable world. We can't wait to see the gardens you create and the stories you'll share. 
Keep exploring, keep growing, and most importantly, keep sharing the joy of wildfowl gardening. And as our wildfowl gardens flourish, let's delve into the deeper nuances and joys of gardening. Eco-friendly pest management, learn about natural ways to manage pests in your garden. Encourage beneficial insects, like ladybugs and lacewings, which naturally control harmful pests. This approach maintains ecological balance and reduces the need for chemical interventions. Garden journaling, keep a garden journal to track your progress, note what blooms when, and jot down your reflections. This journal becomes a valuable resource over time, capturing your journey and the lessons learned along the way. Photographic year in review, at the end of each season, compile your photographs into a year in review album. This visual diary showcases the growth and changes in your garden, providing a beautiful record of your hard work and nature's splendor. Sustainable watering practices, explore sustainable watering solutions like drip irrigation or rainwater harvesting. These methods conserve water, save on bills, and ensure your wildflowers get just the right amount of moisture they need. Hosting garden-themed workshops, share your expertise by hosting workshops on topics like seed collection, composting, or natural dye making from flowers. This not only educates others but also strengthens your skills and knowledge. Interacting with followers, if you're sharing your garden journey online, regularly interact with your followers. Answer questions, share tips, and maybe even feature their gardens on your platform. Building an engaged community enriches everyone's experience. Seasonal wildlife surveys, organize seasonal wildlife surveys in your garden. Invite friends, family or community members to help spot and record the different species that visit. This can be an enlightening experience for everyone involved. Collaborative garden projects, partner with local schools, retirement homes, or community centers to create shared wildfowl gardens. These projects foster community spirit and make the joy of gardening accessible to more people. Annual garden celebrations, host an annual celebration in your garden. Invite your community to see the changes over the year, share stories, and enjoy the beauty of nature together. This can become a much anticipated event in your local area. Reflective evenings, regularly spend time in your garden during the quiet of early morning or twilight. These moments of solitude amidst the beauty you've cultivated can be deeply rewarding and rejuvenating. Closing thoughts, your wildflower garden is a living tapestry woven with the threads of nature effort, and love. It's a testament to the beauty that can be created when we work in harmony with the environment. We hope these ideas inspire you to explore new facets of wildflower gardening and deepen your connection with nature and your community. As our journey through the world of wildflower gardening comes to a close, let's take a moment to reflect on the incredible journey we've embarked on together. From the first sprout to the full bloom of a thriving garden, We've seen how a patch of earth can transform into a vibrant ecosystem, teeming with life and color. Continued learning and sharing, remember, the journey doesn't end here. Gardening is a lifelong learning process. Stay curious, experiment, and continue to share your experiences. Whether you're a seasoned gardener, or just starting out, there's always something new to discover. Building a community of gardeners, let's keep building our community of nature lovers and garden enthusiasts. Share your stories, successes, and even the challenges you face. By sharing, we learn from each other and grow together. Final call to action, before we part ways, I have a small request. If you've enjoyed our journey through wildflower gardening, found inspiration in our tips, or felt the call of nature a bit more strongly, then please consider subscribing to our channel, your channel name. Your subscription is more than just a number, it's your way of joining a community of like-minded individuals who share a passion for gardening and the environment. Also, don't forget to hit the like button and turn on the notification bell. This way, you won't miss out on any of our future adventures in gardening. We have a lot more content lined up for you, more tips, more stories, and more journeys into the heart of nature. Share and connect, follow us on our social media platforms, and share your garden pictures and stories with us. Use the hashtag, 
Nature's Haven, gardens to connect with fellow gardeners from around the world. Let's make our digital space a vibrant and thriving community, just like our gardens. Parting words as we sign off, remember that every seed you plant, every flower you nurture, is a step towards a more beautiful, sustainable world. You're not just growing plants, you're cultivating a legacy of love for nature. So, keep planting, keep nurturing, and most importantly, keep sharing the magic of wildfowl gardening. Thank you for being with us at Nature's Haven. Until we meet again, happy gardening, and may your life be as colorful and vibrant as a wildfowl window. Goodbye for now, and keep blooming, fellow gardeners.